Now we are an independent living facility for active seniors with 84 suites, exquisite meals, and some of the finest residents this side of paradise. Our very popular Good Times room is a real staple of our community. It hosts games, fundraisers, and all sorts of good times. You're a wonderful tour guide. I'm just filling in. Oh, so what is it that you do? Well, I live here. What are you doing? Trying to have a matinee. Did you give your old grandfather a break? Keep your eye on this one. She's here doing community service. She burned something yeah. or Over. someone. Oh. oh my god, what was that? What? No, nope. other way. Probably wondering why the dance instructor doesn't know how to do the waltz. Uh, not really. The last dance teacher was legally blind, so you're a bit of an improvement. <laughs> Any idea who could have done this? God, I don't know. It could be anyone. The residents are concerned about their safety. I'm afraid I'm gonna have to make the hard choice and ask you to leave Golden Seasons. I've been in enough trouble to last me two lifetimes. I can't go out there ever again. You can't retire at your age. It's not right. And don't forget to say hi to your grandma for me. What happened? Welcome to the not-so-golden seasons. Maybe I'll take care of the grill and you go and bust those tables. You just tell me where you want them. You think maybe I could come in? Thought you were a Bible thumper. Dad, don't be weird. Look at him. I just don't want to get you all mixed up in my crazy life. You gotta learn how to relax. That girl has got the greatest set of gazongas I've ever seen. She's also got a criminal record. And look what happened to the last girl that came into my life. It was an accident. <laughs> Well, maybe I'll see you in Boca Raton in 50 years. Doc, open your eyes. You're gonna have an upset stomach and an erection for a couple of days. Good luck. It's a depressing tale. You're a depressing kid.